Almost 10 years ago, I was diagnosed with a rare disease. Everyone was certain I was going to die. That's when I realized that healing and hope won't come from chemicals mixed in any lab. And I needed something much bigger to make me better. Glamour Box is my way of reminding everyone, you have a beautiful soul and a glamorous life. Live it to the fullest and brace yourself because the best is yet to come. Hi Scorpios, welcome to my channel. We're doing your dailies. This is your 12 to the 13. Oh, it's not a pen, it's a wand. <laughs> We're gonna combine this soon, okay? Uh, pen wand, okay. There we go. Dailies, 12 to the 13. How is the Scorpios? Okay, let's see where you guys are going. Is your dailies. Okay. You'll be dealing with an Aquarian. There's a King of Swords at the bottom. Here we go. Scorps. What do you have? Here we go. Got a Prince of Cups, a younger water sign, being swayed, persuaded, feeling um because the prince of the prince of cups over here is that they feel so how do you say breathtaking okay either you or the other person is like oh there you take my breath away okay i think it's a song take my breath away there so th someone is feeling whoa you know um their heart belongs to someone um, um how do you say head over heels this is that one okay this can be the other person let me see Oh, Ace of Swords, and they're, they're feeling that they want to talk to you about it. Okay, Cupid's Arrow. Someone want to talk about how they have been either swayed or persuaded, something like that. It's about a com true and honest communication about feelings um, from each other. Okay, so um, the other person wants to interact and talk about their feelings. Okay, from what I'm seeing here, let me see. Next to the oh wow mm hmm scorps got a two of cups see told you suede not when I say suede not the texture not the fabric okay suede okay. the accent okay persuade so they were suede is that even a word okay persuaded and then there was suede <laughs> I can I'm done. Drop my so it's not a word. Okay, now I understand. So persuaded, not sway. Oh, sway. Okay, so someone was swayed. Okay, it's a word. So it's not S U E D E. Okay. <laughs> so someone, well, both of you are in love. Okay, but you know, there's a communication that needs to happen. Okay. Um, I feel the masculine energy is more submissive, and the feminine energy. Is more aggressive so whoever it's an energy thing okay so feminine aggressive well considering you're you're mars ruled so you are aggressive period <laughs> regardless you are um how does it is feminine or masculine so you are the aggressive one okay moon card okay it's funny because don't worry about the moon card i was just discussing the moon card okay so it's not about secrets it's about a true uh, true feelings because the Ace of Swords is here. First card strongest. Okay, so someone here wants to open up to their feelings. Okay, and this is um, I feel like someone is if they're not gonna yell at you, this is they're screaming their heart. Okay, um, towards you or vice versa. Someone is screaming their heart out, and it's almost like you're not listening. You're not understanding. You know that kind of energy. Let me see. Uh, oh, ooh, of course. Okay, if I still have to say it, you have the Hierophant and you have the Strength card. Mm hmm. You got the whole chart over here. <laughs> you have a Taurus and a Leo. Okay, and they have a Moon. Okay. <laughs> so, this person wants to commit, this person wants a relationship. Okay, so there's nothing happening going on right now astrologically with the Leos, nothing is there. Okay. But there's a lot going in you, okay, Scorpio. Um, the sun is in Scorpio. Um, Mercury is in Scorpio right now. The new moon that is happening is in Scorpio. Um, Jupiter is in Scorpio. Vedic sidereal. Spare me with your Western. Okay, I'm talking about uh, Vedic sidereal. Actual placements. 
So that's why for you, okay, Scorpio, your highlight, I can tell you this, okay, if you're a Scorpio moon or a Scorpio rising, you can sit down and you can marry a frog next to you, okay? You can, you can just sit still, okay, and the planet keeps bringing partners towards you, partner, partner. But the challenge here is, do you know their chart? Because you can partner with someone and if you don't know their chart, you can mess up, okay? You won't mess up because you're just sitting still, you know, look at this, I'm just sitting still. And partners is gonna be brought to you, mm -hmm. It's a transit thing, okay? It's a transit thing, okay? So a partnership is coming your way. Oh, here we go. Balance the energy. The world card and seven of cups. Someone here is Rahu. Okay. Um, uh, the world card with the seven of cups. Because if, okay, ooh, there's an option. Okay, then also the option is done. The world card. Okay, mm, there you go. Mm. <laughs> Some people just want to see the, <laughs> ooh, the traditional. Okay. So the Seven of Cups is realizing the dream. The dream is to have one that is real, okay? Um, which is now they know what they want. They know what is the reality of the connection. It's the world card, as real as it gets. The other person is screaming their hearts out, but they're not talking, but they're about to say something. That you, Scorpio, vice versa, are the world to them. And they want to commit. Plain and simple, peanut butter and jelly. That's how it is, okay? So I'm going to continue this reading. I'm going to talk more about the transit on Chancellor and Extended, um, how this is going to affect you. Okay, 12 to the 13, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you very much, Scorpio. Everything down there, the Emperor for the Tarot class, the Hierophant is there also for the Tarot class. We have two classes now that's going there. Make sure you, you enroll. Um, we also discuss the houses, okay, on how it is. Partnership, marriage, so basically you can do your own prediction, okay? Thank you very much, Scorps, Arvois, Arvidachi, Chow, Chow Mian, Lo Mian, whatever you want to eat for lunch. I'm hungry. Bye, guys.